Boxing Day 2021. Jay Bone and Wilbur Tross were looking to spend their Christmas money, so they headed to Romford Town. After a pie mash, they fancied a bit of fun, so they went bowling. Now, Romford Bowling Alley ain't the best around. It's a bit outdated and a massive shithole, but it was their shithole. Now, today's plan wasn't just to go bowling like a pair of fucking Muppets. The plan was this. They were biding time, waiting for a call from Uncle Mike. Uncle Mike was working the door at one of Big D's clubs around the corner, and the boys were waiting for the call to go and help him. Uncle Mike called and said he only needed one lump. Wilbertross was sent in. When he got there, Uncle Mike was off his nut, and he was looking to party. Big time. Uncle Mike had a tendency to do whatever the fuck he wanted, and this was one of them times. He fucking loved the rave up. He was buying drinks for all the punters, and he had more birds wrapped round him than Hugh fucking Efner. He was in his element. He knew no one could touch him. He was Big D's top boy, and there was good reason for it. Get on the wrong side of him, and you were in big, big trouble. But he was also a cunning businessman, and he'd already mentioned to Wilbertross tonight that he had a proposition. In between all the partying, Uncle Mike and Wilbertross were discussing, scheming and planning. But the partying comes first, for Uncle Mike anyway. Wilbertross wanted to get back to the door, back to business. He wanted to prove himself. It was Boxing Day, a huge night in Essex. Wilbertross had to stay sharp. He was covering for Uncle Mike, who couldn't keep away from the ladies. To be fair to him, the ladies were throwing themselves at him. They wanted a piece of the glory, the fame and the notoriety. Everyone wanted a piece of him, and it was Wilbertross's job to make sure he stayed in one piece. It was on this night that Wilbertross and Uncle Mike struck a huge deal with one another. We agreed to, part, to make a partnership and grow, we'll get and grow our empire. Uncle Mike didn't fully understand the magnitude of this deal. This was the turning point for the Essex boys. Uncle Mike had agreed to a new role. He would be working the popcorn machines at Kidspace. He would have to operate two or three machines at the same time, so it would be an hard graft. Do you want to walk your own? Do you want to walk your own? Alright, Mike, we'll be fine. Cheers, Uncle Mike. Wait, wait, if, there, if anyone takes it, I'll ah! <laughs> Meanwhile, Wilbertross would become head doorman at the majority of Big D's clubs. This would see him gain massive respect in the underworld. Whenever anyone thought of the Essex boys, they thought of Uncle Mike. But now they'd think of Wilbertross. He was rising to the top. Yeah, Will, got you a bit of Chinese, just finished my uh, shift. Got a couple of prawns, Singapore in there, a bit of curry sauce and some Saturday chicken. Right, got three uh, episodes of Hugged Under the Hammer. We called it at 100, have I watched that? Yeah, that'd be good. Yeah, right. We Hopefully it's Dion Dublin. Yeah, Dion Dublin. From the edge of the board.